Reuters reports that insurance giant WellPoint routinely drops policyholders who develop breast cancer. The company, which has 33.7 million policyholders, which is more than any other health insurance company in the United States, uses a computer algorithm that automatically targets every policyholder recently diagnosed with breast cancer. Government regulators and investigators say the software triggers an immediate fraud investigation as the company searches for some pretext to drop their policies. WellPoint declined to comment on specific cases without a signed waiver from the ex-policyholders, citing privacy laws. The tens of thousands of Americans lost their health insurance shortly after being diagnosed with life-threatening, expensive medical conditions has been well documented by law enforcement agencies, state regulators, and a congressional committee. Insurance companies have used the practice, known as rescission for years, and a congressional committee last year said WellPoint was one of the worst offenders. But federal investigators told Reuters WellPoint also has specifically targeted women with breast cancer for aggressive investigation with the intent to cancel their policies. In his push for the health care bill, President Barack Obama said the legislation would end such industry practices. But many critics worry that the new law will not lead to an end of these practices. Some state and federal regulators, as well as investigators, congressional staffers, and academic experts say the health care legislation lacks teeth. Peter Harbage, a former health care advisor to the Clinton administration, said, quote, People have this idea that someone is going to flip a switch and rescission and other bad insurance practices are going to end. Insurers will find ways to undermine the protections in the new law, just as they did with the old law.